or what is up party people yesterday i went over how a casino site was using subdomains and they were ranking in two three days i tested i think how many i tested like six sites six subdomains none of them ranked all outside of the top 10 pages i just need to be upfront about that all right i thought i uncovered something it didn't work i know exactly how they're doing it now and it's href lang abuse spam whatever you want to call it. So if you guys like episodes like this where I uncover the leading SEO's tactics and share them with you, like most people just keep this under wraps, but your boy reveals it all. If you guys like stuff like this, subscribe if you haven't already, like the video, comment HF Lang spam for the YouTube algo, try out ranktac.com, first pin comment in the comment section, and Sign up for the first link in the YouTube description. No plugs today. I'm going to just keep it a buck. All right. Now, for the next couple of minutes, creatine plus report my numbers from the day before. If you guys aren't into that, simply skip on ahead using that YouTube progress bar. All right. All right. All right. So happy Sunday, everyone. I was going to do a live stream and cover this, but then I don't think it gets enough eyeballs. I really needed to like release this because if something doesn't work, and I said it was working. I need, I need, I just need to let you guys know. All right. I just need to let you guys know. Here we go. All right. So yesterday we did 971 until revenue up a hundred dollars from the day before Amazon coming in at 146. Media Vine at 120 and the Adobe Revenue Source at 705. Let's get on with the episode, guys. All right, all right, all right. So if you sign up for the first link in the YouTube description, you get sent the URL to this sheet. Today's December 13th, episodes, no, December 14th. Whoops. Episode 713, not 712, my bad. Um, yeah, you're going to want to see the show notes. All right. Um, first off, <clears throat> the reason why I deduced that you know, these subdomains are working. I think they, they still work. You just need to push it. All right. What does that mean? Exactly. Okay. If you, if you use any like sneaky tactics, like canonical 301s, these show up on Ahrefs. But when we checked Ahrefs on these sites, especially uh, the top casino, Canada, EU, let me show you guys. All right. So best online casino, whoops. Best online casino. Number two. Well, this is a feature snippet, but number one, two is this EU domain. All right. And we can we can learn so much from just like studying what casino guys do because they're at literally like bleeding edge of like these uh, ARBs. And this is the site. Okay. Fine. Looks fine. <clears throat> it was launched three days ago. So ranking in the most competitive niche in the world. Now. I was digging into something like this and it gave me a like a really nice hint, okay? It's a single page site. Nothing else is ranking, I believe. I think nothing else was uh one second. Nothing else was indexed. So if you go here, nothing else in indexed. How do they do it, right? But then then again, you think because they have multiple pages actually. Why is none of it ranking? That will give you a clue, okay? Now, if you go into view source and you search hreflang, whoops, hreflang, they have a plugin installed and a pro plugin at that. That should give you a massive clue already. Why would anyone, especially like a lazy affiliate like me, set up an, an hreflang plugin? You want to keep it as light as possible, right? Less, least amount of actions. So I'm able to de deduce that this is their tactic that they're implementing. hreflang is one of the only ways, I think, forgive me if I'm wrong, to pass on SEO juice with SEO without showing up in tools. So let me show you guys the HRF line. All right. It's right here. 
This webpage, da, da, da. all right, fine. You guys might want to go download hreflang tags for WordPress plugin. Fine. Alternative eu.com slash rankings. Let's go to the page and see what's up here. It looks like this. What's the difference between the homepage and this? Absolutely nothing. It's the exact same content, right? It's the exact same content. Okay, fine. Like, I, I don't know what to do with that information, but that hreflang is E-N-U-S. Alternative. E-N-C-A. Alternative. J like, everything else is like the E-N, like the normal English. Like, general English would go to the homepage. Very interesting. My guess is they have E-N-U-K on another page and then their um, alternative href ENCA is pointing at this homepage. Hence juicing it. That's, I, I think that's how they're doing it. Um, other forums are also showing up as using href lang as like a, a power source. Um, I'm not going to cite which one. I don't want any death threats. Also, Casino guys, if you want to pay me off to shut up, 100k, index.eth, I'll stop talking about it, all right? You guys, you know, if I get paid off, I won't say anything, <laughs> but there will be signs, all right? Now, that's it for now. Let me know what you guys think. I think this is probably the only way that they can do it. There's no other way, all right? So it's href lang or nothing. Google is promoting it. It's whatever, all right? That's it for now. Let me know if you like, guys like me covering stuff like this. Very interesting tactics. Now let me answer some questions from the day before. Wow, a lot of uh, comments yesterday. Jackie, please do a step-by-step -step video. Man, you're the GOAT. Do you have an LLM post for e-com LLM rankings? Do we have to use LLM guest posts for e-com LLM rankings? No, you can use the LLM PBNs. Doesn't Browser Blast only work for aged domains with backlink decent backlink profile yeah um will it work for new subdomain sites we didn't know we tested so you know me I, I tested everything however i do have that was one of my hints i did use a canonical trick on one of the sites i'm going to use the href lang test next all right i got you guys hey i'm looking to understand rank tag more is this something i can use on content generation for my local service clients without taking any risks on getting penalized. Please clarify this a bit for me. I thought I was using AI content isn't good without human edits. So rank tack is mostly for LLMs. It still works for local SEO um, and organic SEO. It's just don't post too much. 30 is the max we'll, we'll allow on any site because a lot of these AI writers want you to use more credits. So you just get clapped. Just, um, yeah, be careful. Don't get it. Are you just cloning the sites to one of those domain TLDs? Or are you also redirecting or doing something else? Uh, I covered it today. Can I use landing page builder instead of WordPress? Yes, you can. I wonder if this would work for rank and rents in high competition. Yes. Subdomain SEO, yes. Less shilling and more food for the boys. Subdomain abuse. Hey, I got it. You know me. I, I got a shill and... Google penalizes duplicate content. The setup risks duplicate content penalties. Subdomains do not pass full SEO value. Yo, I literally showed you the top ranking best online casino page has a literal duplicate content on the home homepage and side page. Just go search best online casino Canada and then check the href link. All right. It's it's the way to bypass. I got you guys. Dude, the things I do for you guys. Bro got cooked in the comments, so it's pretty funny. Subdomain abuse for the algo. You'd be very dodgy when I request for a partnership. Subdomain for the, and you'd be very dodgy when I request for a partnership. What does that mean? Sorry, I didn't quite get it. How can I, how can, can you link it out or spell it out for me? Oh, okay. Yeah. Index checks. Um, Is this one? Index checks. Check it out. Uh, 150 free credits instantly on sign up. 
Also, like any abuse when people are trying to sign up with multiple accounts, we just ban them, and like we just like completely block that whole country. So don't don't ruin it for people. Rank and rent out subdomain. Yes, sir. Subdomain abuse. This will not rank. Sorry, guys. I mean, it's all right. But I don't think, I think he was just being a hater. I don't think he really was reading in between the lines like we are. Anyways, that's it for now. Let me know what you guys think and I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Also, I was going to do a live stream. I was going to do a live stream, show you guys super hard on my services. But today I just give you the sauce. All right. The things I do for you guys, man. Who else is doing this? Nobody, bro. Fucking nobody.